So like, I'm just like, what? And I said, I didn't like the idea. It's boring. No. Uh, <laughs> You're making it so difficult for us to strike. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are you trying to do? To incentivize them, do, do they have like a share in the business? No. <laughs> the question is, can you summarize your decades of experience in the next few minutes for us? <laughs> I feel like that's such a cliffhanger, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> so when do the lawyers come in? Oh, man. It was just a joke. Oh, OK, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm like, wow. How have I just stumbled across this? I was going to ask, did you get nervous before the interview? But I'm kind of half hoping that you're going to say, Marines don't get nervous for interviews. <laughs> An awful lot of details there, just so that we don't know about. <laughs> I would only allow myself to eat if I got a sale. And I would basically sprint between doors. If I got a sale, I'd sit down and eat. Does that answer your question? Um, well, I'm, I'm somewhat distracted by the Charlie bit my finger thing now. <laughs> That's all I can think about at this point. Well, I hesitate to ask what you can see in my physical appearance right now. This is what lockdown does to a man. But um... <laughs> Have you ever wanted to speak out? What we say about ourselves, to ourselves, when we're by ourselves. If I'm doing my business, and if I fall, I'm going to be generously kind to myself, and I'm going to learn and grow, and I'm going to be better next time. In the respect of intelligent people and the affection of children, to earn the appreciation of honest critics and endure the betrayal of false friends, to appreciate the beauty, to find the best in others, to leave the world a bit better, whether by a healthy child, a garden patch, or a redeemed social condition, to know even one life has breathed easier because you have lived, this is to truly have succeeded.